this third child has really messed up my thermostat. I am so happy that it is finally the first day of fall. What is up my friends? Welcome to the third annual fall soup collab hosted by none other than my sweet friend Kat over at Southern Farm and Kitchen. My name is Jennifer and this is Southern Mama Drama. I share my weekly grocery hauls, my meal plans, cooking, motherhood, and lifestyle vlogs over here on this channel. I hope that that is something that you would be interested in and want to stick around. We would love to have you as a new friend here. Just hit subscribe down below and all on notifications and you'll be part of the family here. Today I'm gonna be sharing with you guys one of my favorite soups because guess what? It's quick and easy. And if you know anything about me, you know that I love quick and easy. Something to get my family fed quickly. Yes, cooking in a crock pot is great. Yes, cooking low six to eight hours is great. But sometimes if you haven't planned anything and all of a sudden you got in your mind that you want soup, well, this is a perfect recipe for you because it takes less than an hour to make and is delicious. It's called Busy Day Soup. My friend Laura actually told me about this soup and we absolutely love it because it's quick. Yes, have I said that it's quick? I think I did. Like I said, today's video is a collaboration, which means that you are gonna get lots and lots of a fall soup recipe inspiration down in my description box below. I'm gonna leave the playlist link down there for you guys to go and check out all of my other friends here on YouTube that are sharing their soup recipes with you guys. So we'll get you through fall and winter. We got you covered. Also go over and show my friend Kat some love over at Southern Farm and Kitchen and let her know I sent you. We're gonna get on into this, guys. I'm gonna share with you guys the ingredients that you're gonna need for this really quick. Like I said, it's only five ingredients and I think that you guys are really gonna enjoy this soup. Alrighty, I told you guys this recipe is simple and I am not lying. You literally only have five ingredients plus water, so six ingredients. <laughs> All right, so here's what you're gonna need. You're gonna need one pound of ground beef. You'll need one packet of onion soup mix. You'll need a one bag of frozen mixed vegetables, five cups of water, which is not pictured here. Y'all know what water looks like, right? <laughs> You'll need one 28 ounce can of petite diced tomatoes and tomato juice, and also one cup of uncooked macaroni or elbow noodles. All right, you're gonna need a rather large pot to make this in. This is my huge Dutch oven that I love so much, it's very heavy. Give my pot a little spray of some extra virgin olive oil spray here. And we're gonna go ahead and brown the one pound of ground beef. Okay, so now that we've got our meat browned up, we're gonna go ahead and drain the fat out real quick. All right, so we actually didn't have too much fat in there, but we got it out either way. The next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna add our water in, our onion soup mix, and our tomatoes. Okay, and we're gonna add in five cups of water. Four, we just need one more. Don't forget, if you're in the market for a can opener, this Kitchen Mama can opener is phenomenal. I've had it for probably about a year now and it just keeps on going. I've got a link down in my description box below. It'll give you, I think, 10% off of your order. Highly recommend it. We're gonna pour this whole can in, juice included. All right, I'm gonna give this a little stir here and then we're gonna put the lid on and simmer this for about an hour. See you guys in an hour. Okay, hi, my name is Jennifer and my toxic trait is I have no patience. <laughs> So this has been kind of on warm slash simmer for, well, the timer has 12 minutes left. <laughs> we hungry and I'm ready to eat. 
So I'm going to go ahead and prepare the rest of this. We need, as I mentioned before, one bag of mixed vegetables. And here I have one cup of dried elbow noodles. Going in. And then of course, my kitchen shears are nowhere to be found. Nowhere to be found. Where are they? Don't know. I have to use a knife today. I'm sorry. All right, we're just gonna dump this right in. All right, guys. We are going to kind of bump the heat up a little bit on this because it's not simmering enough for my liking. And we are going to give it a stir, cover it back up, and we are going to let it simmer for 15 minutes. Obviously, to let those noodles cook up. All right, let's take a look. Whoa, mama boiling. Cut it back. Thanks, she's ready. It is time to eat. Yeah, yes, it is time to eat. Alrighty, raise your hand if you thought that was easy. Well, it sure was. <laughs> and we thoroughly enjoyed it. It was so good. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you give me a thumbs up down below. Please don't forget to go down in my description box and check out the playlist that I'm sharing with you guys of all of my friends here on YouTube that are sharing their soup recipes. I promise that you will not be disappointed. <laughs> so anyway, I hope everyone has a wonderful end to your week and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye y'all.